Seriously, the first time I made butternut squash soup, it was disgusting. It was a hot mess. I felt so bad for my family, at least the ones who ate it, which that was just my dad, and I felt so bad for my dad. It was just, it was nasty. Look how much I've grown. Now I'm making soup for you people. You're welcome. You know, the nice thing about working with butternut squash is it kind of coats your hands in this orange permafilm. So if you're on a diet and you're trying to cheat, and I don't recommend being on a diet, by the way, so if you're on one, you should just quit. But if you are on a diet and you don't want people to know that you're eating Cheetos, you should just make lots of butternut squash and then your hands will be covered in that orange film anyway and then you can eat all the Cheetos you want and no one will ever know. <clears throat> That's a joke, you should not eat Cheetos. Those are not good for you. Now remember, if you make our Thai inspired butternut squash soup and you serve it at a dinner party and someone says they don't like it, never talk to them again. Problem solved. I got an email from my mom and she said that she likes my blog. My mom thinks I'm cool. She didn't actually say that I'm cool. She just said that she liked the blog. But she probably thinks I'm cool. I mean, I have a blog when I talk about my mom on it. I think my mom's cool. And if I'm not cool, it's kind of her fault. Hi, Mom.